Hey guys, the objectives of this video are to introduce Hooke's Law and to work out stress and strain in a column under axial loading. So we'll start off by having a look at, looks at Hooke's Law. Sorry, Hooke's Law is this relationship here. We have E equals stress over strain. So this uh, capital E is what we call the elastic modulus. And it's, a, it's basically the ratio of stress to strain. So it describes um, the elasticity of a material. So it basically tells us how much stress. So it gives us a ratio of the stress that's applied to um, how much the material actually deforms. So basically this relationship allows us uh, to work out stress from strain or strain from stress. So if we get one of these, um, then we can work out the other one using this relationship here. Uh, this uh, is a material value, this uh, um, E, this elastic modulus is a material property and it's most likely given to you or you'll have to solve for it um, by using um, stress and strain. Uh, we'll be looking at uh, this uh, concept of elasticity in the next video where we just, where we just quickly run through um, a stress strain diagram. So if we look at an example now, so we've been given this new piece of information and we're going to um, do an example using it. So our first example is going to be to work out the stress and strain in the column. So we've been given E is equal to uh, 30 megapascals. So this is a, this is a fairly um, standard strength for concrete. So we've got a, basically, we could tell that this is 